Are you looking for a BBQ sauce recipe that's a little bit different, a little bit out of the ordinary? A homemade BBQ sauce recipe that's simple to make, tastes great, has a little bit of sweetness, a little bit of spice? Well then this recipe is for you. Welcome to the Sauce and Gravy channel. This is Johnny Mac and we're going to dive into a barbecue sauce recipe, a blueberry chipotle BBQ sauce. Buckle up, let's go! All right, let's go ahead and start off this blueberry BBQ, this delicious barbecue sauce. It's homemade, it's easy. Start off with the blueberries. We're gonna use one cup or 150 grams, throw it on in. And it can't get any easier than this, my friends. For the tomato base of this barbecue sauce, we're gonna use ketchup, simple, easy. Half of a cup of ketchup or 125 milliliters. And now for a little bit of tanginess, we're gonna add a little bit of apple cider vinegar. Half of a cup or 125 milliliters, in it goes. And making a homemade barbecue sauce, it's not only easy, it's just absolutely so tasty. Using that fresh fruit, it just brings out an earthiness, a fresh flowery taste. It's just really absolutely delicious. And next we're gonna throw in a little bit of sugar. One tablespoon of brown sugar, or roughly about 15 grams. This'll help with the sweetness, it'll help accentuate that tomato base and just bring out some wonderful flavors. And the barbecue sauce flavor train rolls on a little bit of garlic. One clove, nicely minced and smashed into the board. And next, for a little bit of heat, a little bit of smokiness, a little bit of spice, some chipotle chili powder. One and a half teaspoons. Throw it on in, my friends, and then we mix. The burner, it's over medium heat right now. We're going to bring this to a little bit of a simmer. Once it starts to simmer, reduce that heat to low to medium, and we're gonna reduce it down for 15 minutes. But check it out, look at that color. Oh, it's a deep bluish red, fantastic. Check out those berries, they're just simmering in there. Fantastic, friends. And this blueberry chipotle barbecue sauce, it is just exceptional. It has a smokiness from the chipotle chilies. It has a little spice from the chilies as well. Sweetness from those tomatoes and also the brown sugar. It's just absolutely dynamite. Goes great with chicken. Goes great over ribs. Throw it on some wings. Put it on some tofu. It is just an absolutely fantastic grilling barbecue sauce. It has such flavor. It's just absolutely outstanding. After you've reduced the sauce down for 15 minutes, go ahead, grab some maple syrup. We're gonna throw in another little touch of earthiness, touch of sweetness, touch of absolute delight. One tablespoon maple syrup, my friends, in it goes. Check it out. Look at that. You could probably just taste the flavor coming through the screen. Look at those colors. It's just rich. It's dark. It's delightful. That deep, deep reddish blue color. Oh, my friends. It is just absolutely dynamite. Go ahead, give it a little bit of a stir, and check it out. You can see where a lot of those blueberries, they've kind of popped, they've ruptured, they've put in their sweetness, their goodness, their delightfulness into the wonderful sauce. Check it out. That's about the consistency that you're looking for right there. And the final step for this barbecue sauce recipe, this beautiful blueberry chipotle barbecue sauce, is to make it nice and smooth. I'm gonna use an immersion blender. Go ahead, throw it in, blend it on up nice and fine. If you don't have one of these, then you can go ahead and use just a regular blender, or you can use a food processor. This homemade blueberry chipotle barbecue sauce recipe, it really is that easy. Seven simple ingredients, 15 minutes, a little blending, and voila. Check it out. You get this rich, dark, red, absolutely fantastically flavored, has earthiness, has a smokiness from the chipotles, a little bit of spice, a little bit of sweetness. It's just absolutely dynamite on the grill. You can go ahead and grab a nice glass container. I like to use a nice mason jar. If you have one of the ones, a glass jar with a flip top, go ahead and use that. Those are also absolutely fantastic to store the barbecue sauce in. But then you're ready to go, my friends, to paint up a masterpiece on the grill. Check it out, look at those colors. Look at that flavor, it's just bursting with delight. Well, I hope that you enjoyed this blueberry chipotle barbecue sauce recipe. Please do leave your comments below. I'd love to hear what you have to say. If you like sauces and gravies and wanna jump on that flavor train, go ahead and smash that subscribe button on the bottom right hand side of the page for the latest and greatest video recipes. And remember my friends, to live, love, and make gravy.